Before using the Zing for the first time, attach the guide cords to each corner of the wing using a bowline or similar knot. The longest cord attaches to the front of the wing while the remaining corners all use the same length cord. To assemble the cord adjuster, thread the cord through these holes covering the MSR logo. To complete the assembly, tie an overhand knot in the guy cord and pull cord through one side of the adjuster to form a loop. When assembled correctly, the adjuster will lock under tension and slide when released. Lay out the zing with the corner pockets facing down and slide all the guy cord adjusters to their halfway position. Peg the two rear guy cords directly out from the center of the wing. Insert a pole tip into the grommet between these corners and erect the pole. Now keep tension on the wing and walk to the front grommet point where you can insert the second pole. Peg out and tension the front guy cord to hold the wing erect. To complete the process, guy out the remaining four cords. Wing structures such as the Zing work best when the fabric is under tension. Once it is pitched, you can increase the tension by adjusting the position of the stakes and retensioning the cords with the cord adjuster. Make sure you pitch the wing in such a way that water doesn't pull. If you have a paddle, additional poles, or there are trees to tie to, additional corners can be raised to create a more open structure. It is best to fit additional poles into every other corner when doing this, creating a well-supported wing that has opposing tension all the way around. Lay out the twing with the pole reinforcement fabric face down. Adjust the guy cords located at the front of the wing to their shortest length. Stake the front guy cords and rear corners directly out from the center of the wing. Now extend the length of the front guy cords using the cord adjuster. To erect the wing, adjust the length of your trekking poles to 125 centimeters or 48 inches. Position them vertically with their handles fitted into the peaks of the fly. Retension the front guy cords to hold the poles in place. Once erect, you may peg out the sides of the zing and adjust the tension as needed to achieve a tight pitch. There are lots of ways to pack up your wing. It can be stuffed, rolled or folded to fit back in the bag. Packing up your zing can be made easier by first stuffing the guy cords back into the corner pockets. Do not leave it packed wet or damp for more than 24 hours. And in hot or humid conditions, do not leave it packed for more than 8 hours. Mold and mildew can develop quickly, causing irreparable damage to the fabric. If it is packed wet, unpack your wing as soon as possible and allow it to dry out completely before storing. 